Muriel. Oh, money. <laughs> so today we're going to learn how to do a basic search on the Grant McEwen Library website. Hmm. Now let me ask you this. Would you like to be able to use the Grant McEwen Library to find a book? Oh yes, I would. Okay. Have you ever been to the Grant McEwen Library website? Um, I took computer course in the My World program and I know uh, how to use internet and uh, I learned the basic layout of this website. Okay, so you feel comfortable going onto the internet and navigating through a website. Yeah. I okay. Think so. Great. Great. Okay. So would you like would you be interested in learning how to use the library website to find a book in the catalog? Oh yeah, I would. Okay. Cuz you're interested in taking books out of the library? Yeah, you know like the, I have the borrow card of the library, but I don't know how to find a book. Oh, okay. Great. Well, after this session, you'll be able to navigate through the Grant McEwen Library website, mm -hmm. and you'll be able to do two basic searches in the library catalog. You're going to do a keyword search and an author search. Great. Okay, so let's get started. So first, what I need you to do is to go to the library website. Oh yeah, I'm here. Okay, excellent. And so, what we're going to do is we're going to find the, well, we're going to locate the Find Books search bar, mm -hmm. which is on that home page of the library website, and we're going to enter a keyword into the Find Books search bar, okay? Mm -hmm. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the demonstration slides, and then I'm going to get you to do the steps after you see the slides. Oh, yeah. How does that sound? Oh, that sounds very good. Okay, so what a keyword search is, is you use a word that will help us find a book on that particular topic, mm -hmm. okay? So we don't need to know the title or the author or anything. We're just going to use a word that uh, is a topic that we're interested in. So let me ask you, what's a, what's a topic that you're interested in? Um, how about painting? Painting? Yeah. Excellent. Okay, so we're going to enter painting into the Find Books search bar, and then we're going to press Enter. Okay. So I just need you to do that step. Okay, so painting. We say the keywords, right? Yes. Oh, yes. Okay. So, we're going to get to our search results, and that's going to give us a whole list of books that are related to painting. Mm -hmm. Okay? And so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to access the book record. Mm -hmm. And the way that we do that is we're going to click on the book's title. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So we're going to go to the first one, which is called History of Italian mm -hmm. Renaissance Art. Okay. So click on that title, mm -hmm. and we're going to get to the book record, which shows us all the catalog information. Okay. Oh yeah. And this is important information for us to help us find the book in the library. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So the first uh, important information is going to show us the location of the book, which campus it's on. Yeah, okay. I don't realize that we have a different campus. Either. Yeah, there's more than one campus, so it shows us which book, which campus the book is on. Mm -hmm. It's going to show us the call number mm -hmm. of the book, so that's going to help us find the book in the library stacks. Yeah. Okay. And then status, that's going to tell us if the book is available for us to take out. Oh yes, oh status. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. So here's that screen there, which is probably the same one you have. Yeah. So at the bottom here, this is the holdings that we just went over. Oh yeah, you know why they have the another holding information on this side? That's a really good question. That holding information is going to show us a little bit more about the author. So there's a link there for the author of this book. So if we would click on that link, that would show us more books that this author wrote. Okay, and then below that is what's called the subject headings. So subject headings is kind of tells us how this book is categorized. So this book is categorized under Italian art. So if we clicked on that link, that would give us more books about Italian art. Oh, it's very interesting. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. Are we ready to go on to the next type of search? Next step. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 
we're going to do the author search. So this is when we know who the author of, you know, the book is we want to find. Okay? Mm -hmm. But we can start from the same page that we were just on because there's a search bar at the top left corner of this page. There's just one more step that we need to do, which is select author from the drop-down menu. So I'm just going to go to the next screen. So do you see the drop-down menu in the far left? Um, yes. Okay, so we want to click on the arrow of the drop-down menu. The drop-down menu. Okay, and we're going to select author. Oh, yes. Yeah, I found it. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then in the search bar, we're going to use the author Jane Austen. But what we're going to do is we're going to put her last name first and then her first name. So we're going to put Austen, a comma, and then Jane. How about if I type the Jane and Austen? You could do that. But this way is way more efficient for us to find her in the catalog, because that's just the way that libraries put authors into the catalog. They always put the last name first. Oh. So it's just a better search technique to use. Okay. Okay? okay. So Next. once you do that, then you click that green arrow. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. and then we're going to get these results here, which gives us a list of authors. And we find the one that we're looking for. Oh. So that would be the third one on the list. We're on the same. Good, good, glad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, and so Jane Austen, 1775 mm -hmm. to, um, what's it, 1817. That's the one we're looking for, so we're going to click on that. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then we're going to get to all the search results for Jane Austen's books. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, but now we're going to add in a little extra step. We're going to use the limit box, okay? Could you please just slow down? Sure, sure. Um, Is there a step that we need to go over? You right say there. Like the limited area? Yeah, let me get to that slide. So the limit box is in the top right hand corner oh, here. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So what that's going to help us do is it's going to narrow down all the books to be at this city center campus. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Right. So can I get you to click? city center so that it's blue, and then press the green arrow. Mm -hmm. Yes. Great. So now all the books on that list are all just from the city center campus, mm -hmm. which is helpful to us because we're on this campus and maybe we just want to find books that are here. Yes. Right? Yeah. Awesome. Okay. So now I want you to select one of the books on that list, uh, Pride and Prejudice, title, and access the book record like we did before. Hmm. Okay. Yes. I oh, see. great. I so, um, <laughs> so again, we see that the location is all city center because we limited it, yes. and then we see where the call number is. So oh, that'll yeah. help us find the book in the library. Yeah. You say call number. Okay, mm -hmm. and then, but from under status, we see that all these books are on loan, so we wouldn't be able to take these books out of the library right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. excellent. Mm -hmm. Well, Mary, I think you've done really well, and I'd like to see you do a keyword search on your own. Oh, you want me to do myself? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I have all the steps up here on the screen, and so I want you to go through and do the keyword search, and I'll give you a keyword. And um, if you have any questions, just ask me. Okay. Okay. What do you want me to search? Uh, well, since you like painting so much, how about we look for Chinese art? Oh, Chinese art. Yeah. Okay. So, okay, I go to my keyword search. Am I right? Yeah. And I just put in Chinese art. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yes, I found. Okay, and just select one of the book records. Okay. And how would you do that? I just click on the title, right? right. And I just click it on it. 
doing the library catalog searches mm -hmm. and you've gained lots of skills here today and if you need any further help don't hesitate to ask any of the library librarians in the library at the reference desk because they'll be happy to help you that's great okay